Boom! What is up? Solo Renekton only here. Back doing some more League of Legends action. We are playing some Nasus in the top lane. We're on the new PBE. Testing out some of the new runes and stuff. Uh, we're doing that Tower Destruction rune again for my boy Nasus here. Should be really good. We're also running um, Ultimate CDR. We're just going to get our ult on a super low cooldown. Yo, get wrecked, noob. Destroyed. Okay, I'll take that trade. I will take that trade all day. I have lifesteal, so... I get health back every time I hit a minion. Plus, I have Grasp the Undying, so anytime I auto-attack him with the Grasp, I get a permanent 5 additional health, along with the... Don't do it, you little shit. Alright, I'll take that. You pop potion here. Nice hit. Use the Q to increase the auto attack range. Keep autoing here. Nice. Some good damage on him. I need to run away immediately to drop minion aggro. Again, leave immediately, drop minion aggro. He's up here. I'm going to try and throw an E on him. Aw, oh, damn. He's just going to back and be able to get back to land. Dang. Elise is, like, right up here, too. But she can't really help. Ooh, get it, Elise! Oh, shit, get it, Elise! Yo, is that it? Oh, my God, no way. Yeah, yeah, you go here, I'll go here. Hey, outplayed, bitch. <laughs> That was so good. Good job, brother. <laughs> oh, man. That's so good. <laughs> so, yeah, you're not going to be able to stack as hard. I mean, there are a bunch of uh, CDR masteries that you can take, and I'm taking some of them. But I think it's better just to go into the... the... Cowsep. Appreciate that, dude. Damn, much love, brother. Ooh! Grassman dying, Brock. I just want to get out of here anyways. Yo, thank you, dude. I appreciate that a lot. Damn, unfortunately, I don't have the 1,050 I need to get the good item. The sheen. It's actually really unfortunate. Uh, I'll probably just go like this and get the potion as well. Yo, appreciate that, Cowsap. Much love, brother. Much love. The master ye god himself. We're just playing on the PBE for anybody new wondering what's going on. I got the wither on her. All I have to do is wait for my home here. It should be a free kill. Boom! See you, bud. I could have waited for his W to land and then queued afterwards. That way I got a stack. It's all good, though. Oh! Nope, not getting that one. We'll just lifesteal back up. We got Doran's shield ticking down. Beautiful. Beautiful. Yo, appreciate that, man. Welcome to the Crocodile crew. I hope you enjoy your stay, brother. Sub hype. But yeah, it's a, so it's a little different because the, the new runes, we can't, you know, just take 30% scaling CDR. I mean, the thing is with Nasus, you're rushing Triforce anyway, so that's a 20% CDR item. And you're rushing the two components first, too. I mean, this game, I'm obviously not. I'm rushing uh, the Phage. I will still, if I have a thousand gold, I'll still go back and get my... Oh, what? It consumed my Q, but didn't give me the kill. Interesting. Or swing. That's weird. But yeah, this guy's going with the stacking up AD, which is pretty solid, too. I want to try that on Renekton. Eh. Just need to keep autoing. Keep autoing. Abuse my passive. There's my ultimate! No! Wow, I got body blocked so hard on that minion. He doesn't actually want to take an all-in against me. Oh, lame. Okay. I really need to try and farm up to a thousand gold. But I feel like he's gonna try and fight me. I'm letting my Doran shield tick away, heal me up a little bit. Obviously I have passive regen. This wave is getting too big for him to fight me in. If he tries to fight, I'll just wither him. Okay. Can't miss any of these. Perfect. I could back right now. Ugh. I can't wait 75 gold in base, though. I think I'm going to shove one more wave. 
Oh, got a bad vital in the front. I'm going to walk off screen. Get a new one that's easily defendable. Nice. I just want to push immediately. He's backing up. Interesting. I think he thinks he's getting ganked or something. Make sure I get that grasp auto attack. Every time I hit him with that grasp auto attack, I am permanently... Get some autos in there. I'm just going to back right now. I have enough for my sheen, so I'm going to go grab it. It's going to give me 10% CDR. Nice. Alright. Let's roll, boys. Let's roll. Yeah, I have the ultimate hat as well, which gives me 5% CDR on my ultimate. Plus, every time I use my ultimate, I get an additional 2.5% CDR. And it stacks five times. So, at max, after I use my ult five times, I will have 15% additional CDR on my ultimate. Just from one talent. Which is, like, my secondary tree. Because my first tree is resolved. My secondary tree is uh, the sorcery. So, I'm getting it from sorcery. Plus, I'm getting the... Uh, Additional stats every 10 minutes from sorcery right at the 10 minute mark. I hit a nice power spike too because I get all those defensive stats from the resolve tree as well That's why like it all works out perfectly with Nasus I'm trying to bait him into dashing so then I just wither him Lame he got the kill again I was literally like one damage off of my Q super unfortunate yeah, we can push this tower super fast. Because I'm also running the uh, tower destruction rune. So, just watch how fast this tower gets obliterated. So, is that full health? Let's go. I have a sheen as well. Just watch how fast. Ready? Here's some big damage. 477. It's based off of my uh, health. So, as I get more health, it gets even bigger. When, I, when we did that Yorick game, I got up to what? Oh, let's use our E for an additional sheen proc. Just so we can get it faster. There we go. Nice. Because our Q's on a 4 second cooldown right now, so we can't uh, just spam Q to get our constant sheen proc. Actually gotta weave in additional spells sometimes. But yeah, the split pushing power of this Nasus build is gonna be legit. Plus, the other good thing is uh, Steric Gage got buffed. Oh, lame. It's one damage off. Uh, Steric Gage got buffed, and it increases your base uh, attack damage instead of being like 30. Hug the wall, boys. Bloop. Adios, bitch. <laughs> I had a giant wave of minions there that he was attacking into. Plus, I've been stacking up constantly. Like, I already have 14 under health. That's huge. Ooh. Ooh, deers here. Uh. I have to fight him in the wave, obviously. I can't run. I withered him. Or can I? Oh, damn. I came so close. Okay. Once I saw him, I was gone. So my plan was to stick around with the giant wave and hope he, he fights into the wave. Which he did. But I just don't have enough mana to finish the kill. If I, if I can get multiple Qs off there, I only had enough for one. Whatever, 74 CS to 47, we are smashing this guy into the ground. Unfortunately, we haven't gotten any of like, the kills, but I mean, what are you going to do? So we got 20% CDR here. Looking good. Just going to teleport back and screw him over on this cannon. If he tries to stick around and greed for it, I just W him. So obviously he cannot get wrecked, noob. And we still got our passive, 15% lifesteal. Yum E. My team is popping off right now, though. That's what I like to see. We're just going to be a god split pusher. And our tower destruction ability is just going to be absurd. Because every time we, every time a minion dies near us, we're also gaining additional health. Every 8 minions that die near us gives us an additional 0.2 health. So every 200 minions that die near us gives us 5% additional health. That's a lot. 5% additional health off of the lowest tier in the resolve tree. Pretty damn good. So we're doing pretty good on our stacks. Not as amazing as uh, previous, because obviously we can't start with as much CDR as before. But we can get a lot and do it very efficiently as well. Because the resolve tree is broken. You just get so much healing back from this tree. 
I think it's by far the best Renassus. You can just build your CDR and your items. It's not really that big of a deal. Ooh. Wait on this Q. Huge damage. You can look for the dive. I'll pop potion here just on full HP. I'm gonna max W here. I'm against a target that doesn't have a lot of armor, so I max W. Dip out. Alright, let's hit the tower. 600 damage on that tower. Look how fast I kill this thing. Hit the tower, brother. No! I can get out of here. Dang. Not enough damage. Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh, my God. Diana's coming. I want to run toward her. Oh, shit! See you, noob. <laughs> Get him, Diana. I can come back around. Okay. <laughs> That's great. Get me out of here. Oh, yeah. The other thing about the Hysterics gauge that I didn't talk about is... Just give me one second. Is... Grab this. Okay. The other thing about Sterix Gauge, you see the uh, passive effect on this, the actual damage component to Triforce. So it's dealing 189 damage right now. That's that's uh, That goes off of your base AD. Base AD is how much AD you start the game with, plus the AD that you get each time you level up, right? It's like a couple extra AD every time you level up. But yeah, there's no way of increasing that outside of getting Sterix Gauge. So Sterix Gauge also increases your base AD. So I get like 50 additional base AD, but it increases my my procs. Oh god, I just all in here. No! Get that movement speed off the minions. Aw, oh, you little shit. Got one. Got two. I got a kite here. Oh, dude, just too much minion damage. That's bullshit. I did not take 38 damage from both of them. Get the hell out of here. Each one of those ranged casts is doing 10 damage a pop. Are you kidding me? It's trying to tell me I took 38 damage. Okay. Sure, dude. I died to... I died to... Uh, 360 damage. Yep, that makes sense. <laughs> they need to... If they fix anything with this game, they gotta fix this thing. That's the thing that most annoys me. And it's super annoying for, like, new players, right? Because they use it as a way to, like, understand what's going on. <laughs> like, they look at that shit and they're like, uh, so what do I need to build, right? What do I need to build for? I'm going to get CDR boots this game. Yo, thanks for subbing, bro. I appreciate that shit. They look at that and they're like, what do I have to build for? So when they see something that says mixed damage, like they go against Kale and they don't understand that she has a magic damage shred and it's the mixed damage is really more magic damage heavy. So they end up itemizing the wrong things. Like, that's very bad for a new player. It's an easy way to fix, or easy thing to fix that would help a lot of new players out, I believe. But yeah, thanks for subbing, brother. Appreciate that. Yeah, the Sterics build is great for tower taking. Like I said, Triforce procs get increased. We'll get like 350 damage Triforce procs. And remember when we looked at it earlier? It said 189. So, it's gonna be a big proc. Especially when you add in the fact that we got that tower destruction rune that's scaling off of our health. We have our Q that hits towers. We, have, we also can ultimate to get our Q at a reduced cooldown. You're just going to have a little bit less stacks. So I think 300 by like 20 minutes would be really solid. I'll be quite happy with that. Now you can change up your rune page so that you can like rush more CDR. I just don't think the trade off is worth it. I just think you get much more out of the resolve tree. They might try and team fight, or the two of them might try and fight me right here. Damn it, I didn't see that guy was coming. I would have stuck around. Oops! 
I flashed and he still took the kill. This this guy's what the fuck? What? You know how NASA's works, home homie. Do you know how NASA's works? I am a god right now. Don't try that shit on me. Uh oh. What? Ooh, that connected. Oh, wow. Huh? Why are you so afraid? Why are you so scared? You are fed as fuck. I'm strong. What? Why don't you just kill them? You have six kills right now. We're against an 07. This is the only guy doing any damage. He's like one hit away from dying. You, you just go in and kill him. The fuck? Alright. Whatever. I feel like we could have just fought and won that shit very easily. Oh well. Ooh, nice reflex. <laughs> it's like, come help me. <laughs> uh, grab this. Just TP back top. Pressure this lane. I want this tower real fast. All right. How much have I gained off of my, uh... So I've gained 113 health off of this growth one, which is when minions die near me, I gain additional health. Holy shit. The squad. like 1v4ing up here. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> yeah, I, I think I'm pretty strong. Unfortunately, they keep bringing 40 people. And I'm getting stunned for like 9 hours. But that has resulted in them not having anything in bot lane. Losing a mid tower. Potentially going to lose a second one. Nice. So the rest of my team super fed and I keep trading even. So I'm fine with that. Um, I think I sell this and grab this here. It's a little bit annoying that I have to go against like 15 people every single time, but you can see the amount of damage I'm pumping out. And I'm real tanky. So I got all that lifesteal. So, yep. And this is giving us a bunch of additional stats. It, you just become this giant ball of stats, dude. I love it. Grasp the Undying. We have 724 total healing off of it. It's also done 800 damage extra damage and my health has been increased by 145 that's from each hit gives me five additional health right whoa rift herald oh no <laughs> all in for that movement speed. I got the wither on him. He doesn't have W anymore. I can just keep chasing it. Oh god. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna leave them like they leave me. <laughs> See ya. I'm out of here. Oh, Lim. Just trying to get that stack. Watch how fast we can take this mid tower if they let us. They're all chasing bot lane. Watch how fast this tower is going to die. We need to shove this wave in first. Come on! Watch how fast this shit dies. 800 damage on that proc. See ya! <laughs> that is disgusting. Nah. I don't feel like... I don't feel like going down there fighting that guy. He's annoying as fuck. The ooh deer. He just keeps running at me and stunning me for four minutes. Then I eventually die. Alright, let's get out of here. I got enough of my item. Are they gonna screw? Ah, oh, he's right here, dude. That's so annoying. Oh shit, Chogat's here too. Hello! I can't get eat by Cho. 
That's just as painful. See you, choke gath, you little bitch! Fuck that, I'm flashing. Adios! I kind of screwed myself against Cho because I hugged the wall so I couldn't dodge uh, left. So he could like place it toward my right and cheat to that side. Nah, dude, I'm just going to go buy my item. I have so much money to spend. And boom. Also, alternatively, we could get the Kindle Gem early. Just so we hit that 40% CDR a little bit faster. Like, we can rush uh, these two components. Like, you could do a CDR rush if you want. Like, you don't have to rush all these items, right? You can, you can go for... The uh, two components of Triforce, look at this, 317 on that bonus damage, like I was saying, because we're getting 53 extra base AD here. And then when it pops and activates, we get even more. And we get 30% tenacity when it's popped as well. They just buffed uh, Steric Gauge quite a bit, so it's a much better item now. It used to be only 30%. But yeah, like I was trying to say, you can, if you want to rush the CDR and try and get as many stacks as you can possibly can, Kindle Gem uh, boots, and then you just rush the components of... Uh, these two components. So a thousand, uh, two thousand one hundred and fifty, plus eight hundred, plus your boots. So pretty good deal. Uh, we should try and go here. We take this easy. I'm not doing terrible stack wise though. Pretty solid. Pretty solid. Uh, rip my team, but it's all right. I'm doing my job. I'm backdoor this thing. Come on, you stupid minion. Oh, is it still hitting me? There it is. So this goes off after four seconds. That's what it's counting down. You have to stay within 600 range. I just hit a tower for 1,400 damage. What the fuck? They're sending everybody. I don't know why. What are you going to do, goofball? I'll go right for this guy since he's stronger. Adios, you little bitches! Woo! Come on! Big dog Nasus in the building! Come on, son. You get so much damage off of this when this shit's activated. Holy fish moly. Alright. Let's clear this out. Let's get the hell out of here. Here. You, you seem poor. Have some gold. <laughs> Alright. Let me get out of here. How much am I off? Isn't it 2,000? Yeah, okay. So I'll just wait a tiny bit. It's only 40 gold. I have teleport up, so I'll just wait a little bit. Teleport. We're good. Damn, these new runes on Nasus are sick. Plus, I really like the new Sterics gauge. I think this buff is huge. Because, like I said, it used to be 30% of your base AD. Now it's 50. That's huge. Because that all gets amplified into Triforce. This is, what, this is perfect for Triforce Steric users. Which is like Yorick... Uh, Mordekaiser. I don't know what else. There's a bunch of them. Really solid build. Even Darius can use it because Darius has super high base AD already. So you're scaling off of a higher number. Because different champions have different uh, base ADs. Like Darius, Mordekaiser, Garen, Alawi. Those are all super high up on the uh, base damage numbers. And then obviously, like, you know, Sona and stuff like that is super low, right? Because they get less AD per level. Whereas the champions like Darius or whatever are getting much more. Alright. Let's take this out. Auto Q for 900 damage. Hello. Boom. Almost at 400 stacks already. It's not even bad. What do you want, punk? Bloop. <laughs> Meanwhile, I'm just going ham on the tower. I don't care. 1,600 damage. Boom. You're dead, too. I've had enough. Turned on beast mode. Taking out towers. <laughs> Look at this shit. I don't care. The world is collapsing around me, but I don't care. I will end the game, boys. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> So good. So good. What a game, dude. I'm really liking the new ruins on Nasus. Uh-oh. Thank God I got that game in.
Now the PBE server is done. What? I don't even get to see my stats? All right. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that game. That's some beast mode Nasus right there. Uh, if you enjoyed that, make sure to drop a like, subscribe, all that cool stuff. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.